Tonight on Metro Atlanta Community, mourning the death of a 19 year old Marine. Lance Corporal Jonathan Gerke was killed after a crash near his base in North Carolina. The military vehicle he was riding in lost control and flipped. 17 passengers, including Gerke, were thrown out. CBS 46's Adam Murphy live at Collins Hill High School in Swanee, where the young Marine is being remembered tonight. Adam. Good evening, Karen. There are many students here in the ROTC program at Collins Hill High School in Gwinnett County who remember Jonathan Gerke and were deeply saddened by his passing. And I'm told they intend to make sure he is properly memorialized and never forgot. He's a kid. I mean, he was a kid to me. Um, he meant a lot to our program. Master Sergeant Jeremy Renault fought back tears Friday while talking about the loss of one of his former ROTC students, Jonathan Gerke. It's tough to deal with. Um, I dealt with it a lot when I was on active duty. Um, and then coming into this program to, to teach kids, I never anticipated I'd have to deal with anything like this. The 19 year old from Lawrenceville was one of two Marines killed Wednesday when the tactical vehicle they were riding in rolled over near the intersection of Highway 17 and 210 in Jacksonville, North Carolina. When we talked to our, our juniors and seniors and notified them because those were the group that was still close to him. They, they were freshmen when he was a senior here at Collins Hill. Renault described Jonathan Gerke as a leader who racked up hundreds of hours of community service and inspired everyone around him. He was a four time national uh, award winner, community service national award, American Legion national award for excellence, Tuskegee Airmen award for national um, recognition. So he wasn't a kid who was just coming into the program to hang out. CBS 46 met with Jonathan's family at their Gwinnett County home. They said he would always light up a room with his smile and loved what he did. He met me at the door when I walked through the ROTC door, the door as a brand new instructor with a cup of coffee. And he said, Sergeant Renault, I'm Chief Master Sergeant Gurk, I'm your command chief, and I heard you like coffee. And I said, I'm going to love this kid. Yeah, there were a lot of people that loved that kid. I'll tell you what, he was in the top two to three percent in terms of physical fitness in the ROTC program. And on top of that, he also was in the rifle program. So what I'm being told tonight is all of the students have decided they would like to remove the rifle he often used and put that out of inventory and then create a memorial. It's a tough loss for this community. Live in Gwinnett County, Adam Murphy, CBS 46 News. He is being